my, my, my. You know what? You're a better cook than my mother. Dora, you have many hidden talents. Oh, this is truly delicious. Thank you very much. The boy must be hungry. He can come to the table, can't he? No, he can't. I'll feed him in a minute. Finish what's in front of you first. Did you get there all right? Don't worry about me. I'm doing fine here on my own. Give my love to my aunt, okay? When this is all over, I'll come and pick you both up. Oh, Mom, okay, okay, okay. I will lock the door and close all the windows properly, okay? Listen, Mom, you do remember that I used to be a cop, right? Okay, okay, I won't go on about it anymore. Come on, hang up, Mom, I'm busy. Please, give my love to Inez and loads of kisses. Yes, bye, talk to you both. I'm so sorry, I thought you were one of them. I wasn't thinking straight. I mean, as if he would just ring the doorbell. Are you okay? I'm sorry that I scared you. Are you okay? Huh? Take that, and I'll never surprise you again. I just thought that we could have some dinner together since we couldn't have breakfast today. <laughs> well, now I'm in no condition to eat. Well, I'm starving, so I'll just eat the whole thing, okay? <laughs> Are you hungry? Look what I brought for you. Come on, sit up. It's lentils. Dora cooked it. Do you like them? I do. I like lentils, too. She has cooked them very well. Any news from Ethan, brother? I wonder what the lawyer did. Let's just see what he's up to. I kind of freaked when you took so long to open the door. Why's that? Yeah, I don't know. A man all alone, all by himself at this time of night. Maybe I would catch you in an inappropriate oh. situation. I don't know. I've been caught, huh? Oh, I forgot the girl upstairs. She must be hungry, too. Sarpy, come on down. We've been caught. <laughs> you don't need to, uh, hide anymore. <laughs> Unknown number. Mason. What are you up to, Mr. Lawyer? Is Ethan out of jail yet? No, he's not coming out. And you'll be going with him. Look here, you punk. I don't think you understand. So start getting your act together. Was it that guy? What are you going to do? I need to speak to Mrs. Layla urgently. So you couldn't make the man talk? Unfortunately. I saw him today too, and he didn't say a single word to me. What did you do, Layla? Did you actually go to the guy and beg? It could actually serve us better to have him on the outside. He doesn't talk no matter what we do, yet he might try to contact his partners if we let him go free. Then we could follow him to reach the other guys. That way we'd have a better chance of saving Kareem. It seems like a pretty sensible tactic, if you really think about it. I think it makes a lot of sense. You should be careful. And don't ruin things again with one of your cunning plans. I know that I can get them to set the man free if you'll agree to it also. Well, I trust you. Do what you think you need to do. <laughs> 